morning guys welcome to today it is pitch black it's almost 6 a.m and we are headed to the barn for our show lesson. for our show go put those in the front come on let's get going we actually have to go um gabby already set up storm's hay bag is ready to go our neighbors are probably like oh my goodness why is this big huge thing out on the middle of the road <laughs> i see one neighbor's awake actually 5 a.m and we are in trouble but we don't really care tell ourselves there's always too much this is the hard part making sure everybody has all the stuff all their stuff i think we are ready to go sophie where'd you put your boots and your belt uh, in the tack trunk in the tack trunk okay things were all over this time we like are better prepared we know more what we're doing but yeah everything was a mess all right you guys let's do this let's go to the barn Woo! all of our friends are right behind us we beat everybody to the barn uh it is 6 13 we're supposed to be here at 6 15 and um, we got here just in the nick of time and everybody's right behind us. But it will still be fair. No, they don't pick us up. Instead, they knock us down. And that's the way it goes until we're in the ground. I don't want to do this anymore. No, I just want to say. Chihuahua's wearing boots. Hey, Chihuahua! And that is safe to say. No, they don't pick us up. Instead, they knock us down. And that's the way it goes. Until we're in the ground. I don't want to. have to take him out. You want to put him on the driver's side. But my dad has to move the head. Yeah, Sam made a mistake. He forgot that the heaviest horse has to be on the driver's side. Yeah. I knew that rule. Sam didn't. Never read that manual. Never read it. No, don't. He likes the hay being there way better than Stella. I know. He's like, that's the best looking horse I ever saw. Wait, it's coming, Storm. It's coming. We got you a new hay bag, too, so you wouldn't be stressed out. This is the new hay bag. There's a hole on this side. Okay, put it up there quick. I forgot I wanted to get bungee cords to hold everything down. Yeah, he's he's more than happy to be in here. We're here. One of the best things about coming to the show is seeing all the horses. Like, there's a gray over there. It's got some and a Palomino staples. with the blue halter. Should, and a Palomino right with the blue the, uh, halter. Yeah, so anyway, we can't park in our usual spot today because um, they have a derby in this show for the last show and everybody's here early. Usually we're here first and now everybody's here. And Sam's getting to park the trailer for the first time yeah. in front of all the people. It's kind of cool out. Wow, he either pulled out all that hay or he ate a lot of hay. You need to restuff that? half pulled out. Half eight, half okay, like, Poor Sophie up. fell. Got bloody knees. Perfect day to show. It's nice and cool. Yeah, and you don't need a phone to show. Yes, I do. So Storm did awesome on his own. <laughs> He's like on to eating all the hay. Like I'm eating all the hay. Hey, maybe let me move. Oh, you should put that rubber on there. Yeah, hold on a second. Fresh green grass, and I'm more excited about the hay. I just want to say hello.
looks like oh, grass. He just goes right down through the grass. Wait, take off his shipping boots. Oh, weirdo. <laughs> For some reason, I feel like he looks really good today. I know. Even though we lost our show sheen. Looks good. Yeah, he's like, who are you talking about? <laughs> Let him see it. He's like, <laughs> that's like what the heck is that? Monster. I feel like Storm's super energetic today. I gotta braid his hair still. Um, I braided him. Thanks. I braided him here at the thing. I watched a bunch of videos and then I got a couple of little tips and we, tricks. Mom buttoned him. I buttoned him. But um, yeah, it's not perfect because his hair is really short and because it was my first time. But the first one where the hair was thick, I did. I, it was really nice. The rest, his hair is kind of not awesome. So yeah, I'm excited. I love doing it actually. Anyway, we've been here for like about an hour and got all of our mess here. Um, Gabby's finally just getting Storm already. He seems like he gets really excited when we go to new places. We definitely need two totes or grooming boxes or whatever you want to call this thing because um, we have just too much stuff to go in it now. Look at this puppy that came to see us. It's a Harlequin the Great Dane. Look at the other puppy that just came to see us. So tall. Right there. No, right there. Storm. Yeah, I can't see it through the box. Storm. Oh, the there's puppy. another puppy. Oh my gosh, Storm's like oh, right up close puppy. and personal with this. <laughs> He's like, let me smell your butt. Huh? <laughs> there's the other puppy. Gabby, look at Storm. Oh, there's two. Oh, no matter where Gabby goes, oh, the dogs like find her and gravitate to her. And Storm's like, <laughs> I'm going to eat that Storm, tail. You want? <laughs> no, it's so funny. I hope it does not go badly. Stay there, puppy. Don't be bad. Hey. <laughs> Good boy, he's a baby. He's a baby. The other one's a boy. It's a girl. So cute, though. Yeah. Oh. Like, okay, let's eat the girl. Storm. Okay, you guys, look who showed up at our show. Hi. This is Kyla. This, if you guys don't know, is Storm's first owner. Or the two owners ago mm -hmm. she sold him to the person that sold him to us and so she came yeah. all the way here just oh, to yeah. see him and cheer you on for just a little bit of your road already no not yet we have a while to go yeah i'm so glad you came though that's so oh, nice o'clock 3 p.m neither of the girls have ridden yet it's scorching hot it feels like 37 degrees it's finally time it's finally time to at least tack up the girls are almost ready probably another hour maybe and then the girls will finally get to ride and then we'll get to show you guys but I have to tell you one of the girls in our barn rides Spencer and she's been riding him for a couple of years this is her very last time riding him in a show because she's outgrown him she took the championship for her division and then there was a derby here and they had to do all these crazy jumps like just crazy stuff and it was there was 14 people in that division she came second second on teeny tiny spencer like that boy loves to jump and claire rides him so good and yeah they came second in the derby like yeah amazing so it's her last time riding him and she was like such an amazing farewell right so uh poor storm is probably dying of the heat and i'm gonna put this big huge heavy thing on him brand new He's like, what? It's just too hot. I'm going to get you a drink before we get started. When you're at a show and you have to improvise, you use your cooler and climb on your horse. All right, Storm. He's like, I've been sitting here all day eating. I'm ready to roll. I'm ready to go out there and see the world. He's ready to ride. There's 15 people in Gabby's division. She just warmed up. You guys saw a little bit of her warm up. Storm is like, let's do it. <laughs> and Gabby's kind of excited too. On the rail and a walk. Trot please, all trot. Like two magnets, we are drawn to each other. You just know how to push all my buttons. Moved out of town and I erased your number. But still I find myself calling in the middle of the night
sock, please. Stitching sock. Walk, please. I'll walk and reverse and walk on. Working trot rising, please. All trot. Lengthen the stride, please, in the trot. Lengthen trot, rising. Walk, please, all walk. Uh, so we would like to have all the riders line up in the middle and then we're going to ask select groups to canter at different times. So the group that was in the middle, you're now going to be walking on the rail on the left hand side, on the left rein. Sitting trot, please. Sitting trot. Canter, please. All canter. Walk, please. All walk. And reverse and walk on. Please, all canter. Please all walk and line up with your numbers facing the judge. They're having a few minute break in the middle of the division so that everybody can have a drink.
I'm like this. So. Kind of. You're doing good though. So this is pleasure hack. You are now being judged. Please remember to spread out on the rail. Working trot rising, please. Working trot rising. You send chills down my spine. Said I'm not worthy of your love. Well, this is definitely goodbye. Oh, it was fun having you around. Looking in the rearview mirror. Lengthen the stride, please, in the trot. Show a lengthen of the stride in the trot, please. Never find somebody like you. Walk, please all walk in reverse and walk on. Working trot rising, please. Working trot rising. Walk, please. I'll walk. And we're going to be looking for the following riders on the rail. If I do not call your number, you're lining up in the middle. No, he's not gonna buck. You always ride, stirrupless. Love, love. That was a hard group, but you did awesome. Yeah, and you have another show next week, and it's a jumping show. Your first ever jumping show. It's gonna be awesome. It's hot. So this yeah. is. I don't even know what time it is. Look at. It. I think we all got a little bit burnt. It's 6:30. 6:30, and now we're just waiting because Gabby has to um, spray a storm down for the ride home because 
he, I mean, it's hot. It's, I mean, the last little bit now has been a little bit cooler, but he needed to be cooled down. These are the extra treats. Those are the treats that Sophie won? No. Oh, those are the treats. Kaylee, we didn't tell you guys, Kaylee actually. They're extra. Kaylee actually came first. She won champion of the whole thing, and they miscalculated. Reserve champion. Yeah, they no, they miscalculated. Oh, no, she did. She, they said she won reserve, and then when they recalculated the results, she actually won champion. Uh -huh. You look so pretty with curly hair. Anyway, he's having some treats. So Kaylee gave Gabby the extra treats. That were at the Thingy. Right, we are back. It is 7 p.m. and we're all exhausted. I think we all got a little bit of sun too. How did you feel after that show? Do you feel like you did your best that you've ever done with him at yeah. a show? Yeah, me too. Storm was the most forward he's been at a show. He takes little bites. Out. Gabby was keeping her legs as quiet as she ever has before. She was keeping her hands more quiet. She worked her hardest and did her best. Oh, Good boy. that was bad. He slipped on some poop. That'd be a lesson to you. Poop is slippery. <laughs> Right, let's see. We got here at the barn at dawn, and now 12 hours later, we're back. Like, shows kill me, and ours is just like a little small show. I can't even imagine those guys that go to big, huge shows. So, the girls have all taken down their horses and are letting them out. Plus, they'll help with chores because our instructor was with us all day. And so they all help and do water and all that good stuff. Oh, my blood sugar is even a little low. Usually we take so much food with us, but this time we're like, you know, we took some fruit. We bought hamburgers there and I'm so hungry. Are you hungry? Star. Yeah, like we are so hungry. Um, one more show. Every time we go to a show, I'm like, oh, I can never do that again <laughs> because it's so hot and so much work. And then the next time we get ready to go, I'm like, yes, let's go. I guess that's what it's like when you go to shows. <laughs> 